He's going to need extra time to get his second win of the year. Stuart Skinner looking for his first. And McDavid, Dreisaitl, and Bouchard, the usual suspects, sent over the boards by Chris Knobloch to start overtime. Philadelphia will counter with Couturier, Travis Konechny, and Travis Sanheim. So three proud leaders on the Philadelphia side. And here we go. Five minutes for the extra point. Hard dig, and Dreisaitl muscled that face off over to McDavid, kick back to Skinner, and it's an Oiler reset to begin overtime. Shots were 13-8 Edmonton in the third. Here's Bouchard, kicks it back to the on-rushing McDavid. He'll be defended by Konechny and Sanheim. Dreisaitl one touch, gets it back from Bouchard. McDavid lost the handle. And he'll have to drift back inside his own blue line. No change coming for either club as McDavid challenges again. Sanheim back defensively. McDavid shovels it across, picked off by Konechny, and now the Flyers have some numbers. Konechny hits Sanheim to the net. Couldn't drag it back to his backhand. He was taken out. That's going to be the breakaway for the win. McDavid in on Erson. Denied! What a save, Erson. Center pass, drive title, shoots and scores. Edmonton four. Philadelphia's irate. Uh, irate. Oh. That was unbelievable. I thought there was going to be a penalty on this play driving the net. I mean, it was a turnover by McDavid in the offensive zone. Connect me, find Sandheim up the ice. And then he drives this one to the far post. McDavid is all over him. Now we'll have to take another look at it, but he can't finish it off with McDavid in there. And then everybody blows a wheel in the, in the corner and he's off to the races on a breakaway. Here it is, here he spins. I mean, he doesn't get it in there that tight, to be honest with you. He kind of puts it in the area, but he doesn't really dig in. And I think the speed of Sandheim takes him down. Here's the breakaway. Can't finish it off of the backhand side. But then he finds Leon Dreisaitl. A quick little hesitation, and he buries it. The inside of the right post. Give Harrison a lot of credit. He stands his ground on McDavid with a breakaway from the hash marks in the defensive zone. But it's Leon Dreisaitl that finishes it off. And I think the Flyers were shocked there wasn't a call on the play, and they all kind of looked around to see it by that time. The Oilers were off to the races, and what a comeback win. I mean, this game had a lot of everything. Well, the bounces weren't going Edmonton's way early, but they certainly went their way in the second half of this game. And here's again the call. Now, there's the stick in there, and it's not much, but he certainly gets his arm in there a little far. No call on the play. Sandheim goes hard into the boards. And then it was the second Philadelphia player that blows a wheel coming into the mix, tied up with another Edmonton player. And Connor McDavid just goes, okay, no penalty, I'll just take this puck and gone. And because Sanheim's down and out in the corner, he's unable to reel in Leon Dreisaitl. Yeah, he could have finish. stayed with him with speed. I don't know if he would have been able to reel him in anyway, but 